Hello Riverbank, this is Mr. Gianelli with your technology tip of the week. Today I'm going to be talking about how to make bookmarks in Chrome. And this is going to be a way for you to uh, save websites that you've used in the past. If you're not using Chrome, I am going to recommend that you switch uh, to it from Internet Explorer. It's a lot um, more user friendly with uh, apps, with all the Google apps that we're using. It works a lot better. So I would really suggest that you make that switch. So I'm going to go ahead and open up a new tab here. And you'll notice that I already have a ton of bookmarks right up here. And some of them are organized by folders. And some of them are not. So if I want to go to Classroom, I just click on Classroom button. And I'm there. And uh, so how do you create these little bookmarks? Well, let's go to a, a website um, that maybe I haven't gone to before. If I just do a search for, uh, let's say, puppies. And then I'll go to, um, what's a safe site that's not going to get me in trouble? Let's go to the puppy Wikipedia page. Here we go. All right, so I'm at the puppy site, and let's say I want to go here often. This is something I want to save, like something like Google Drive or Classroom. I click on this star up here, and it's got this long name. I can rename it so it's not quite as long. It might make it a little easier for me. I could just say puppy wiki or something like that. Um, and then I'll just, where do I want to put it? Bookmarks bar means it's going to be right up here on the top. And that's fine, so I'll just stick it there. I have so many that it's actually, it's actually putting it way at the bottom. And if I wanted it to be on the top, I just drag it to where I want it, and there it is. It fits in place. Now, you can only have a certain number um, on the top. If you can't fit them all, just click here, and there's the rest of them. So that's how you simply create a, a bookmark. I also have a video game design folder, a graphic design folder. So let's say I wanted to add a, a, uh, something to my video game design class. So I'll just go to YouTube and I'm, I don't know, looking up uh, texturing Unreal. So tells you how to texture in Unreal. I'm going to take this video link and I'm going to bookmark it. So again, I'll just click on the star. And then instead of just saying bookmarks bar, I'm going to say, hey, put this in my video game design class. And again, if I wanted to rename it, I could. Um, I'll just put Unreal Material. Click Done. And now when I go into my video game folder, you'll see that it sticks it at the bottom. And again, you can move these around whatever order you want them to. Uh, so there it is now. Drag it and let go. So um, yeah, that's that. And in case you're not seeing your... Uh, bookmarks try opening up a new tab they should appear then I have it set so that they're always showing if they're not always showing for you you can change the settings although it looks like mine's been locked recently so right here under settings I went a little fast there but you click on these and you go to settings and there's a button right here that says show the home button and there's my home button right there and then this one says always show the bookmarks bar. And apparently that's been locked by my administrator. So I can't change that. But in case that is not checked, you probably want to check that. It makes it a little bit easier um, for you to get to your websites. So there you go. That's going to save you guys some time. And I really recommend if you're using Chromebooks in your class, you're also having your students do this. This is uh, going to be an important skill for them to learn. And it's going to make life so much easier when you want to go to those sites like Moby Max or Classroom. You just have the students click on a button. They don't have to type anything. And uh, that's really one of the benefits of using our um, school logins. Those will stay with them every year. So when they transfer to you know high school, those bookmarks will still be there when they log in to the Chromebooks here at the high school. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Have a good week.